Throughout the course of the 10 hearings held by the January 6th committee, it became clear that there were two key witnesses whose testimony could reveal more about Trump's plan to overturn the election than any others. His vice president, Mike Pence, and his chief of staff, Mark Meadows. Both men refused to testify before the January 6th committee, but after a subpoena and uh, quite a bit of litigation, Mike Pence did testify last month before the grand jury in the special counsel's January 6th investigation. The special counsel himself reportedly sat in and listened to the former vice president's testimony. But what about Mark Meadows? Meadows was with Trump in the Oval Office during the attack. He was involved in the fake electors plot. He was in communication with state lawmakers about efforts to overturn the election. He even reportedly burned documents in a White House fireplace. We know that Mr. Meadows complied with a D Justice Department subpoena last year for documents and turned over the same text messages that he provided to the January 6th committee. But he was subpoenaed again for his testimony earlier this year. And a federal judge later ordered that Mr. Meadows comply with that subpoena. Whether or not he has actually testified is anyone's guess. But the lack of information here has led to speculation about whether Meadows is a criminal target of this probe or whether he may be cooperating. One thing we do know is that Trump's Save America Leadership PAC gave a nonprofit run by Mark Meadows it gave it a million dollars in the summer of 2021, which is a pretty tidy little sum. And that same Trump PAC paid nearly $900,000 to McGuire Woods, which is the law firm that was representing Mark Meadows as of late last year. Now, to be clear, we don't know if that $900,000 payment was for Mark Meadows' legal bills or if it was for something else entirely. But today we got this, which is a new clue from CNN. A source close to Trump's legal team said Trump's lawyers have had no contact with Mark Meadows and his team and are in the dark on what Meadows is doing in the investigation, fueling speculation about whether Meadows is cooperating with the special counsel's probe or if Meadows himself is a target of the larger investigation. In the dark. That cannot be where Trump's legal team wants to be on all this, especially because the former president appears to be kind of antsy over reports that special counsel Jack Smith is wrapping up his probe of Trump's mishandling of classified documents down at Mar-a-Lago.